Hello my friends and welcome to another Disney vlog. It's an exciting day. I'm kind of going to the park later than usual. It's like one o'clock-ish. I'm just waiting for the train to arrive. I'm Disney bound as Ariel, so I've got my um, flounder Sebastian earrings. I'm kind of dressed like, you know, Disney bound. So I'm very excited. So the focus today is I'm gonna go around looking at the merch. I want to see the Halloween parade because I've not managed to see it yet. And we're just gonna go with the flow other than that. So there's two goals other than that. We'll see what happens. Some characters would be great, some rides would be great. We'll see. Let's see how it goes down. It's a beautiful day, the sun's out, but it's a bit breezy, so it's not too hot. So I'm very excited. I cannot get over how beautiful a day it is. Yesterday it was a bit rainy and cloudy. Today, pure blue sky, it is gorgeous. Like, oh, I'm just so excited to be here again. I will never get sick of it. Like, oh, the music, everything. I'm so excited. So I've walked straight into Flights of Fantasy starting and I have to say it's quite empty here today. The rows are clear, um, everyone's getting their position to watch the parade and we've got um, drumming and stuff going on. So I'm going to pop into the shop because I've seen it several times. Let's go look at some merch! Okay, as I come in we have got a whole kind of Duffy collection Halloween stuff. It's in a really cute um, stand. So. We've got Duffy himself. He is 198. Shelly Mae, what a cutie. I think they're all the right, the same price, but they're dressed so cute. Oh my goodness, look at you. Now, is this Stella Lou, am I right? I'm trying to remember their names. I'm not very good. No, Gelatoni. Gelatoni, I will remember that. Are you, are you Stella Lou? Yes, you're Stella Lou, you're cute. And this is Cookie. They're really cute, so for collecting. I'm gonna go round the stand. You've got little key rings. They are each 138. So they're really cute. Oh, I like this. They're a little, little cutie. And you say, stop, stop saying cute. Right, some, some collection. They're mo oh, I like the pumpkins. That's quite a different one. They're mostly like the kind of Duffy collection. Jack Skellington, that's pretty spooky. I quite like that. Um, but they are uh, mint. What does that mean? I'll find out. We have got some sweet gummy mix um, candy, which is 98. We've got a notebook, which is $88. That's quite nice, I like that. And a cute frame. Yay! How much is that down for? Oh, it says 50% off. I don't know if that's true, but 158, 50% off. Not bad, man. Not bad. And as we go around the corner, we've got a bit more. Oh, these. Are these hair ties? <gasps> They're hair ties and hair clips. Now, that's adorable. I like that. That's 148. You've got some cute little pens with, like, dangly pumpkin and magnet sets they're nice the magnets are again 50% off nice 118 and 118 so 50% off I guess Halloween's coming to an end right let's see what else we can find okay so just next to where we were we have got this is quite a cute thing right I'm gonna have to try and put it on <laughs> I've got a massive head so it's probably not working very well on me but that's quite cute so as you can see it's got the it's got the ears like yeah that's like oh there you go it's it's like pinged to the top of my head that is cute if you've got a small enough head I like that that's 198 quite different cat hair <laughs> and then we've got some of the cute little bags so let me get it right Stella Lou Halloween bag and a cookie Halloween bag and they are both let me see the price 178 and then you've got a little kind of cute outfit I don't think it will fit me though so I'm kind of focusing on Halloween merch today but you can't ignore these look at that hat that is amazing um, and it's 178 though it's in a stand that says 20% off but then look look at this jumper I love it, it's a new arrival. Um, I think it's amazing. It is um, $359, but how 
cool is that I like that a lot and it's kind of a really thin like wool but quite um I was gonna say quite thick but I've just said thin so I don't really like it's really solid but like it's not gonna be really thick and hot so I don't know I don't know what I'm saying I'm not a textiles person I have found some Halloween key rings. So we've got Mickey 118 as a little vampire. He's a cutie. We've got Minnie as a witch, and I think she's the same price, 118. We've got Jack, which is like a classic. Why are you spinning? Are you haunted? What's happening? I'm, like, I can't use my hands. Um, I don't know how much you are. This is brown. I'll find out. But look at these. These are quite funny. So that's um, Judy Hopps. Hello under there, Judy Hopps as a ghost, and who are you? Oh, Mickey as a ghost. That's kind of cute in a weird way. Um, I don't know how much brown is. I'll find out. Brown is $99. And we've got the same um, key rings that we saw earlier over here. Slightly off what I'm looking at today, but this looks like the closest Hong Kong's got to a spirit jersey. <gasps> I really like it. Oh my goodness, it says new arrival. Disneyland on the back. And it's kind of that material that I always think is like, um, it reminds me of Ariel. It's that kind of swimming material, I don't know. Um, oh, hold on, it's not quite what I thought because I thought this was the back, but that's the front actually. Um, so that's the front, nothing on the back. Kind of crop. Um, let me have a look for price. I do like it though. Where is the price? Where is the price? Why is stuff so hard to find the price for? Am I gonna find it anywhere? Is it on the sleeve? Right, let me find the price. Okay, so literally none of those have the price on them. So I don't know, maybe maybe it's free? But I do like that. I, it's a shame it's not on the back because for some reason, like, I feel like that's not quite a spirit jersey at the moment. Um, however, they, I mean, they've got a few Hong Kong Disneyland jumpers. But anyway, let's go find Halloween stuff. Halloween! So I've tried this on before. This is really, oh, where's her rubber horn? There. So I like this hat, but I'm not a hat person particularly. But um, I wish they had ears just for her, for Maleficent. This is 178. And then I start to fall in love as we have the purse from, um, oh my goodness word, Loungefly, and it's gorgeous, and it's quite pricey, it's, oh it's not too bad, 318, which if you think is about equivalent to like 32 pounds, so what Hong Kong Disney have started doing are these ears, like plain ears, where you can like mix and match the bow, which is quite cool, we've got a Maleficent notebook, which is, uh, oh again 50% off, 108, that's not bad actually, I quite like this t-shirt, Queen. Um, I'm not doing very well with clothing prices. Here, here it is. 258, that's quite pricey just for a t-shirt. And then, so we've got some of the bows to go on the ears and then, whoa, whoa, I'd be so cool with these. Maleficent shades. I need them to go see the film this week. I'm excited for it coming out. I'm so excited. I can't find the price for those, but oh, oh no, now I can't hang them up. It's all happening, it's all happening. Okay, right, let's run away. Okay, round the corner. Ooh, okay, we've got similar t-shirts. This one's quite cool, it's got a netty bit. I think it's gonna be quite pricey. Um, but it's like a proper villains kind of thing. It's got a netty bit, it's got a strappy bit. Like to me that sounds like, that's like bad. I'm a rebel because I got netty bit and strappy bit. 278, I think that's quite pricey considering the purse is like only 30 pounds ish. This is quite cool, however the print, her face is quite terrifying. I know it should be, but like, I don't know, for some reason that scares me a bit. Let's see how much she is. 228, which isn't bad for a big bag. I don't know, I don't know if I'm, I don't know how I feel about this. Then you've got the little like makeup thing, 138. Uh, oh, you've got her on an umbrella. That's pretty cool. 198. Like a whole lot of range going on here. Oh, hello, Sally. Um, let's do this side. Oh, this is pretty cool. Hong Kong Disneyland notebook. Let's guess. It's going to be 50% off. Yes, I'm correct. 108. We've seen you already, and we know brown is $99. Oh, hello. What is this? A 
it says if I press zero, are you gonna wake up? Let's try this one. Zero? Ah, hello. Light up zero on a leash, right. Well, why wouldn't you want that? Oh, oh, I pressed it again. I thought it would turn it off. Oh, now he's flashing. Now he's off, okay. Um, and he is, I don't know. He is 118 and again, 50% off. They're obviously getting rid. That means Christmas is coming. Okay, we've got Oogie Boogie as a plush. That's pretty adorable. Um, he is 128, a zero one. Um, he is 98. I've got zero at home in England. This is pretty cool. It's like a, like a clip. I can imagine like wearing it as a bow tie or something. I don't know what I'd clip it to, like my neck skin, I don't know. Um, $99. So these are quite cute. Um, they're all, are they earrings? Are they not? Are they? Yes, they're earrings. So odd earrings, I like that. That's 128. And then you've got a Jack Skellington ring. We've got a, oh, sunglasses. Oh my goodness, I find those hilarious. And there are Sally sunglasses too. And then like, we've got a kind of makeup bag thing, I'm a jiggy going on, 138, Nightmare Before Christmas. The scarf's pretty cool. I do quite like, I don't wear scarves, but that's the only reason I wouldn't get it. Um, it's 158. I mean, why wouldn't you want Jack Skellington hands? Plus it's 50% off, 138. Not bad, not bad. And here they are themselves. And I think they are both 198. They're pretty cute. I like them. Okay, the last bit of Halloween in this bit, I think. So we've got a few like glow-in-the-dark t-shirt things going on. Um, I believe these t-shirts are over here proving, proving their existence as glow-in-the-dark. Uh, we have our Halloween ears that are over here. So this is the witchy one. I believe it is 158. That's quite cute. And I bought these myself. I assume they're the same price, 158. So I... <laughs> I don't know guys, what do you think about this mug? I'm, I'm not sure I like it. I mean, I just don't get that face. It's half price, it's 128, so that's not a bad price for a mug overall, but I'm not sure I like it. We've got more sweets, more sweets. We've got a very spooky Mickey down here. Half price? Oh, it's not got a sticker, $78 though. We've got children tops. This is pretty cool. Key ring. Does it turn, oh, 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 whoa, that's a bit much. Um, oh, you can put it on different modes. That's pretty cool. Um, this neck thing. Uh, oh, it's got the battery thing, but you can buy a like neck garland thing. <laughs> I think it's called a necklace, not a neck garland, but. You know, $88. And then you've got your classics. So we've got Chip and Dale as like Frankenstein and Frankenstein's monster. Like, they're cute. Uh, you get both of them for 218. We've got Pluto as a mummy. <laughs> That's quite funny, I like that. 168. We've seen Mickey and Minnie. Um, let's see if we've got anything else over here. Now these are amazing. I kind of miss my decorations, Halloween decorations I've got in England. I love this. It's like a big cookie jar or something. I couldn't find the price last time. These like glow in the dark stickers. 55. What is this? Um, what are you? It's 128, but I don't know what it is. Who knows? Um, we've got this is better, I like this more. It's got a spoon in it as well. So he's cool. He is 128. And then we've got a very bling Jack Skellington down here, which is really cute. You guys, I'm in such an empty shop. There's no one here. They're all out either at the parade, but even the parade's not busy. It's empty here today. It's great. I'm, I'm having a delightful time. So that's most of the Halloween stuff that I saw in there. They have got, these are new arrival. Um, let me just show you. I'm kind of focusing Halloween, but when I see new things, I'll show you. So we've got a huge Mrs. Potts. I like her, but I've got one in England that just has slightly nicer eyes. I'm quite fussy with eyes when it comes to anything. Um, I want to see the price. Oh, where is the price, man? 
There has to be a price somewhere. Hmm. I don't know where the price is. Why is this such a challenge all the time? I'll find out. And then I think he is adorable. Look at him. It's a bit like the Primark one they did a little while ago, but where you get the spoon as well. And oh, he's just got such a cute face. Now he's 128, so that's quite cute. Um, why is there no much price on Mrs. Potts? But anyway, I thought they were quite nice. I found our bling um, Jack Skellington out, so I thought I was a bit safer looking at him. He's $188, but he is cute. I think you can put a candle in his head. Yes, you can. Um, I like him. Bit of bling, never hurt anyone. Speaking of which, Frozen 2. I like that. That's cute. So it plays Into the Unknown, which is going to be the new Frozen song. That will be cool. Um, we've got it up here out of the box. Um, yeah, that's quite cool. I like it. The thing you didn't know you needed. A set of Duffy and Friends Halloween tea towels. How much are you? 128 and you get three of them. Not bad. Not bad at all, my friends. And they're cute. Look! Oh wait, I picked all three up. Oh, why can't I do things? Yay! What a cutie. Oh, and more of those hair tie things. I, use, I have a bunch of those. Just see if there's anything else we missed. Oh, we haven't seen this before. Uh, this is like a trick or treat bag. That's quite cute. Um, it's 138, half price as well. And then we didn't see these earlier. Are these earrings? They are. I'm liking this odd earring kind of thing they're doing. So they're Duffy earrings. They're really cute. I didn't look at the price. 148, not bad, not bad, not bad. Uh, we've seen all this. What is this, man? Whoa. This is a dress and a half. I'm, I am stunned. Shelly Maybag, Shelly Maybag, one day you will be mine because I love you. You guys, I found the dress that shook me, shook me to the core. Um, this is something. It is $278. I think, I, I haven't got words for it, but I've just been distracted. Whoa, look at these. I'm getting real like Legally Blonde kind of, um, you know the, the brunette one in Legally Blonde? I'm getting that kind of vibe. I don't know why. But that's like quite cool in a kind of repulsive way. Um, and then, <laughs> oh, I'm harsh. Um, and then I like this. Look, look at the buttons, the details. It's so cool. Oh, hey, oh, hey. It's quite cool because it looks like it's just sitting on my shoulders. And instead, he's a hat. I mean, that's pretty cool. Um, it's not very secure. Because, like, if I do this, it falls. But, like, maybe just don't do that when you're wearing it. But, that's pretty, like, stunning. And how much is he? 228 For a hat you didn't know you needed. So, guys, sunglasses, anyone? Look at these! Oh my giddy aunt. These are brilliant. They are stunning. Um, and they cost about 158 each. Stunners. Well, this is something I didn't know I needed. They are random Toy Story earrings. <gasps> I'm in love, Toy Story 4. Oh my goodness, 169 for all of those random joys in your ear holes. Irresistible. So I'm now in line to meet Mickey and Minnie. I've never met them at Hong Kong Disney before because the queue is always insane. But it's quite empty here today, so I've decided to get in line. They're in their Halloween stuff. And I'm gonna make it a goal to meet Mickey and Minnie every season because I think that's doable. They're not the kind you'll meet more than once because the queue tends to be quite insane. But I think it's worth it because they're right in the middle gazebo and it's gorgeous and like life's good. So I'm excited. Freaking story of my life. Second from the front and they've gone for a break. Why? Why does this always happen? Look at them go. Be worth the wait. They look cute. Oh, look at them. They're so cute. Oh, they're flirting. That's cute. Minnie's got swag. 
They're on their way back. Look at them. So majestic. Lady, you're in the way. Why would you try and move that bench? <laughs> Look at them. Yay. <laughs> Hi, Mickey. Hi. That's a camera. Would someone hold this? It's a video. I, 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 someone is me. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> okay, no problem. It's spooky. It's spooky. It's spooky. It's spooky. It's Okay, hold on, thank you. Next time, we'll be together. Yes? Yeah? I think it would be a lot of fun, especially in the sunshine. Yeah? Oh, that'll be perfect. Hi, how are you? Hi. Very hot. Okay, look here. Hi. Well, they are just adorable. I enjoyed that a lot. So, I'm deciding whether to go to Daisy or a Duffy character. I might go to Duffy because that's quite rare. I don't know if the line's open. Let me check. The line's open and it looks like it's Stella Lou. Is that Stella Lou? Yes. <gasps> I'm excited. Can I give you this as well to hold? Wow. Yeah. Oh my goodness, you're the perfect ballerina. Do you know what I'm dressed as today? I'm a mermaid. Yes, yes. I like swimming along the side, but I'm not very good at like ballet. Oh, you're so good. <laughs> oh, wow. You've clearly been practicing. I can try. <laughs> Yay! Oh, you're so cute. Okay, look at here. One, two, three. Okay. Bye. Thank you so much. Bye. Thank, thank you. you. Bye, so Stella. Oh, so much. <laughs> Bye. Okay, thank, thank you so you much. So much. Oh, Bye. So, Stella Lou was beyond adorable. I met her at Easter last year, so I'm glad I met her in her Halloween gear. So I'm obviously on a character mission. I am now in line to see Donald and Daisy in their Halloween gear. They look so cute. I'm excited. I haven't left Main Street. I need to go get some water, so I think I'll meet these two. Then I've met everyone who's out today. I haven't met Chip and Dale yet in their Halloween stuff, so I'll need to do that next time. Um, yes. It's going well. I'm having a delightful time. Look who's walking past. Hi, Goofy. Oh, and there's Pluto. Hello, say hello. That's so cute. <laughs> so when Goofy and Pluto walk through the doors, they open the doors quite wide, like the cast member doors, and I spotted Christmas. I don't know what Christmas, but I just saw Christmas. Like, if you saw it, you'd get it. It was Christmas. It's coming. It's coming, my friends. What are we? The 15th today. We're halfway through October. 15 days, 16 days, 31 days. Um, Christmas be coming. Donald's coming back out without Daisy. I'm happy to meet Donald, but I thought it would be them both. That's a shame. That just means I have to come again. You win some, you lose some. Hi. Hi. Thank you. Donald, I'm so excited to see you. Wow, you look so good in your Halloween gear. You look really nice. Yes? Oh, how clever. What have you built? Have you built, like, can you, have you built something to fly? you built something, uh, like, a robot? Yeah? Oh. <laughs> Is it a nice robot or a scary robot? Oh, no. 
Um, I'm not sure I'm, I'm a fan of that. It's a bit scary. <laughs> You guys, look at Main Street. Like, it's empty. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. So, I've just met Donald. Um, he was a delight. I'm now gonna go get water because I said I would and I should and I will. And I'm just gonna like walk us over to the castle because each time I come, there's a little bit more on show. But also, let me just show you. There are some new balloons. Now let me try and angle it. There are up balloons. Let me see if I can show you. Can you see the up house and the balloons? <gasps> so cute! I love them. Also, I am dressed right because I've been given so many Ursula stickers. I love Ursula, she's so cool. Um, oh my gosh, Chip and Dale are down here. They've swapped places. Oh, but I need to get water. I must stay focused and hydrated. So I'll quickly show you the castle and then I'll get water. I must get water. I keep getting so distracted. Oh, uh, now I can't use my hands. Why? Basically because of the sun you can't really see it, but it's so hard to know what this is gonna be. It's got some like colors from like Disneyland Paris. It's got some like yellowy um, kind of aerial vibes, but it's also got some kind of Aladdin vibes. I can see a bit of like Beauty and the Beast going on. I don't know. I love it. I just found Moana. Oh my. Oh my. Hello, Moana. I am. I am. I am. I Seven, and Naomi still has not got water yet she met Moana so balances things out right you can't oh I see Rafiki oh. will I ever be hydrated no no I will not I don't care so apparently Rafiki is not accepting lines he is just making the wise decisions as to whether he'll meet you or not and like I think I think he'll like me. <laughs> Let's hope. Let's hope. Oh, hi, wise Rafiki. Hello. I wondered if you would read my palm today. Are you doing like? Are you being? Oh, oh, you look very, very clever. Yes, yes. What wisdom have you got to show us today? Okay. Oh wow. Oh, I don't think I could do that. 
That was like a smooth, one smooth move. You look very zen, very peaceful. Yes. Yes. Yes, it's good. That's all I want to hear. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. My my heart and my brain are rich. Yes, that's that's good. I like that. Thank you very much, Rafiki. Thank you for meeting me and choosing me. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Day 78. There must be water nearby. I see some. <laughs> I'm so thirsty. <laughs> right, I found I found some fountains. Let's do this. Let's do this, my friends. Five minutes on my favorite. Well, five minutes cube even. What is going on? There's literally no one here. It could just be me on this ride on my own. This is crazy. I like it a lot. This is just my general face today, it's like full on smile. So I was for the first time right at the front of Grizzly Gold, which was so fun. I really liked it again. Um, the breeze was a dream. Just had so much fun. There was like two other people on the ride with me and they were like at the back. So gave me plenty of space to stretch my legs. Not that I stretch my legs behind me or even that I stretched my legs to be honest at all because I wasn't doing that. Well, I've made this conversation awkward. I need to go. <laughs> my favorite Rex is here to greet me as I come in. So I've kind of gone the reverse right way into Toy Story Land. I'm just gonna kind of walk through, see what's going on. Just kind of have a stroll before I see the Halloween parade. Um, yeah, pretty delightful. Jesse and Buzz are out over there, but the line's closed, but they look cute together. I wonder if they act romantic, because like, obviously they're a couple, but oh, I better move, because these people are taking photos. Look at hey, that pose. Hey. Stuff's going down. <laughs> What's going on? Anyway, I'm walking into fantasy land. Um, <laughs> no idea what was going on over there. Ooh, there's a crowd. I like a crowd. It means exciting things. Let me go see what they're crowding for. Someone's waving. Hmm. Oh, there's a crowd. There's a line. These are my ex my favorite things. The princesses are out. So we've got Ariel over here, which would be ideal for me to meet today, but it looks like the line's closed. And then we've got Snow, which is amazing. So they're just out and about. It's because their princess place is taken. So that's really cute. So at the moment, because of all the renovations and different things going on, there are a lot more spontaneous characters out and about, which is great and exciting, but you can't schedule it. So I find that slightly challenging because I didn't know the princesses were out. I've now missed the line and I'm a bit like, oh, well, great. But then like, I've seen, I've met both Ariel and Snow White other times, so it's fine. But yes, just so you're aware, if you're coming soon, like, the scheduled ones aren't happening. They're just out and about spontaneously. So just be aware. I love seeing what people are wearing out here. I might see if I can do a, a Hong Kong Disneyland fashion because there are two girls walking past who are dressed as Wendy. I feel rude just filming them. Maybe I'll see if I can do it one day and just ask people if I can film what they're wearing. Would you be interested in seeing that? Let me know, because at the moment I'm just kind of filming. I focused on shopping today because Maria wanted to see the shops. So please let me know if there's something in particular you want to see in Hong Kong Disneyland, and I'll do it for you. Right, let's see what's around the corner. The time has come for me to have my first Mickey ice cream since I got here. Um, I'm excited, it's very warm. I'm gonna find somewhere I wanna sit for the parade, and yes, I'm looking forward to it. I'm trying to work out where I can go, where it's so the sun won't be high, be, uh, speak, woman. <laughs> I really can't. So the sun won't be behind the parade, so I don't just get silhouettes, but we'll see. Mm -hmm. mm. So I'll be honest, I have no idea where this parade is coming from or going from. For some reason I've got a feeling it's not the usual route which would come past here, because no one's along here. Normally, like, 
the pass like it's empty where's everyone so i've sat myself here because like the sun is behind me so i can then like the sun will be on the characters rather than behind the characters i've been told i have to be behind a line i'm behind the line i don't know what's going on and they've set up like a little like metal thing near me and i don't know what's going on i'm excited i might not have a good view sorry in advance at with the parade is getting the children involved so I didn't really film that bit but there's a whole section in the middle where they had any kids who had costumes on do a little dance so it was really cute I mean I was hoping there'd be a few more villains and stuff in it but it was a cute parade it was kind of like very um children young children worthy so I'm now heading out of the park I've had a delightful time, managed to meet so many new characters. I saw the Halloween parade, which was lovely, really cute. Saw all the shopping stuff. It's been really good, so much like within like just a few hours. And on that note, I'm gonna love you and leave you and I'll see you next time. Boop. <laughs>